What's up, family? This is my review for the movie Till. Just got out of seeing it, and a um, bunch of cowards throughout the movie, dog. Like, I was upset watching it. First off, let's give it up to all the actors, the people that um, directed it, you know, the, the production of it. They did a great job. Clap it up for them. They did a great job, but, bro, I was frustrated watching this. It was so many cowards in this movie. And of course, you know the people that actually um, killed Emmett Till, cowards. The, the, the chick that's in the, the store. I mean, all of them, they deserve a needle. I mean, this is how I see it. And I'm not one of them people that's like, oh, you gotta forgive and forget and let go. Forgive and let go, nah. I ain't one of them people, man. You do like something like that, everybody involved that's directly involved supposed to get the needle, like in my opinion. But them wasn't the only people that was directly involved. And this stuff that I didn't know, bruh. Like I remember watching, or not watching, but hearing about Emmett Till when I was younger and it actually did shape my life. I uh, remember that, or I started thinking about that when I was watching this, like, man, that, that really shaped my life. Cause I heard about Emmett Till at 11, and I'm gonna tell you how I shaped my life at the end, but dog, it was black people that actually assisted them in doing what they did. For some reason, in my mind, I thought that Emmett Till happened when, or his death happened because he was walking down the street alone and people rolled up on him and got him by himself. It's way worse than that, man. They actually went up in a house and grabbed him out of house. It's no way you supposed to allow that to happen. And then once it happened, as the movie kept going, you find out that the older dude that was up in the house actually had a gun. Dude, why do you got a gun if you ain't gonna use it? Like you let somebody come in here and take one of your younger generation, one of the people from your younger generation, you gotta understand where you at in life. Like, First off, them kids should have told him before that so he could have got uh, Emmett Till back up to Chicago. But that old man should have knew where he was in life. Like, dog, you done live most of your life. You're going to be, you're going to pass away in the next 10 years anyway, most likely. 10 to 15 years. Get that young man a shot at, at life. You know what I'm saying? Like, you supposed to take both of them out. <laughs> Everybody get in the car and just roll out. Y'all got to go up to Chicago. That's what, that's just, you know, how it had to be, you know, and then eventually the cops would have came and probably got you and you would have went to jail and died in jail or they would have uh, gave you the death penalty or whatever and that would have been that. But you did what you were supposed to do. Like, under no circumstances do you let them come take somebody out your house. But that was a coward move right there, so they was cowards. But it was black dudes that was with the uh, white dudes that came and took him out the house. Like, dog, you gotta have a bird brain to do something like that. And you know what? It just wasn't the, the dudes that actually did the crime, but it's also the jury, the judge, the lawyers, the cops, everybody that's in that town, that's in that area. They all, um, you know, played a role in this. Not saying they all deserve to get the needle like the people that actually did the crime, but they all played a role. You know what I'm saying? So it's just crazy how it was. Now, me, when I see movies like this, I don't get um, too caught up in it because I study history and I know that we was up way longer than we was down, man. So um, <clears throat> I don't be tripping off of that. Now, I did realize that Emmett Till really shaped my life because I heard about him when I was young and then I thought about it. I realized I don't approach white chicks. I never have in my life. Not saying I never talked to a white chick or, you know, been with a white chick. That'd be a lie. I'm not saying that, but I'm just saying I never approach them. But I approach every other just of course, black chicks, but every other, you know, ethnicity or race. You know what I'm saying? Like, I will approach them, but with white chicks, it's like, I, for some reason in my mind, I be thinking, dog, I, I can't risk getting no type of, any type of case put on me. So I'm not even risking that. 
And actually, matter of fact, the last white chick I talked to, I didn't approach. You know what I'm saying? We was in the gym. She was smiling at me for a while. She was cute, too. I, I just smiled back. Hey, you know. Uh, and then one day she came up and was like, uh, do I know you from somewhere? And I'm like, that's when I was like, okay. She'd been, she been giving me the signals, but I still wasn't going to approach her. But when she came up talking about, do I know you from somewhere, it's like, sweetheart. I stay on the outskirts of St. Louis right now. But, and this is where we was at on the outskirts. And I'm just like, sweetheart. I was in the Navy. I've been gone for years. And then I grew up on the north side. You don't know me from nowhere. Like, in my mind, I'm thinking this. So I'm like, okay, let me go ahead. So I, what's your name? And then I got a number or whatever. So, um... That's how I typically always go, you know, when I do talk to, to white chicks, you know what I'm saying? So, but Emmett Till definitely shaped me, man. Movie was a emotional one, but bunch of cowards throughout it, you know. So, great job for the people that made the movie because they captured the emotion of the movie and it was shot well. Um, so, I'm going to have to give the movie out of seven stars. I'm going to give this one a 6.3. I don't know how accurate everything in it is, but just as a movie, just looking at the movie, judging the movie alone, yeah, 6.3, man. It's Mac the Guru. Remember, if you're still here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Click that like button. And like always, man, y'all be easy, be safe.